yes I am back I am going to do a comment or suggestion tonight and react to that video the commenter is K-A-H over here what did K-A-H suggest that is a great question hopefully the sound is a little bit better I might have to still play with that a little bit more but we shall see we are going to look at winter sun suns of winter and stars so we've had enough adieu let's hear it To discuss that a little bit that's nice I love the music he's got a nice little rough voice not one of my favorite voices so far it seems to be nice but it's not it's not something that I would go out of my way for yet but let me hear a little bit more it's it's a nice growl to it but it just maybe it's because just very recently i was listening to some more amorphous so maybe i'm not getting that same depth that i get from from tommy's voice so i don't mean to compare let's get back to it i want to hear some more and see how this sounds here we go <laughs>
absolutely love the music. The guitars, I love their sound. Love it. Absolutely love it. Guitars, the drums, love all of that. Let me get back to the vocals again. I don't know what it is. His vocals just aren't clicking with me for some reason. They're good, but in my mind, and again, this is why there's different types of music some people like, some people don't like, and this kind of goes somewhere in the middle for me. I really like the music. I really like the guitars, the sound. I don't dislike the vocals. But they're just not enough for me to really... I don't know. I, I don't know what it is. It almost seems to me like he would be really good if there was a contrasting element. I'm thinking... Maybe on the lines of like an Epica has, where you have the harsh and then you have this beautiful clean. I would love to hear. Now, let me know. Let me know if they have any songs with maybe other vocalists or anything that are like that. Because I think I would really like his voice if it wasn't the main course. But. I'm still going to keep listening. I'm going to keep listening to this song and I'll listen to some more of them. Because I could be one of those things that maybe it doesn't hit me right away. But after I hear a few times, then maybe I'll get into it. Like I've said before, I'm not going to sit here and lie to you about how I feel. That's pretty much how I feel right now. But let's hear the rest of this. didn't mean to cut right there in what sounds like a great musical run right there. I like that last bit. That last bit, maybe he's growing on me, but I liked those vocals. I don't know if it's just that little part that I liked, or like I said, maybe he's growing on me, but I really like that last little bit right there. So, Let's continue. Maybe he will continue to grow on me and I will be singing praises by the end of this. Let's see.
You can hear me over the song there. But what I was saying is I loved that last part. That was great. I liked their harmonizing and his rasp stood out really well there. I think it's just when he does extended growls, that seems to be what starts to lose me a little bit. Once he starts mixing it up, I love the contrasts. Okay. Sorry, let's get back. This is a fairly long video. I didn't happen to notice before I started it how long it was going to be. I thought we were coming to the end there, and I looked and saw we're like only halfway through. Let's get back.
Okay. That was Winter Sun. Sons of Winter and Stars. I gotta say, I liked it a lot more by the time I got to the end. I still run hot and cold on his voice and his growl. But I like it a lot better than I did at the start once I got to hear more of his layers that he can do. And once they started doing the harmonizing as well, that was great. I am definitely going to give these guys another shot. I'm going to keep listening to some more and see what I think. I'm still not overwhelmed. But that could change. Let me see some more and see how it ends up. Now, as I normally end things, be good to each other. And keep your eyes to the sky. Take care. Mm -hmm.